thunder can be heard in the air this weekend in Virginia Beach, and we're not necessarily talking about the weather. The NAS Oceana Air Show is back in town. Students today are getting a sneak peek, and it opens to the public tomorrow. Attending your side, meteorologist Ricky Matthews joins us live with local pilots performing at the air show for the first time. Ricky? Yeah, local pilots called Warbird Thunder Aerobatic Team. They're going to be flying both tomorrow and Sunday out here at the NAS Ocean Air Show. Flying starts around 10 a.m. I would expect them probably a little before noon. So if you want to check them out, make sure you get here early and beat that crowd too. There's a huge crowd that usually shows up here a little bit later. Let's show you some video of them. And uh, this is Chris Thomas and Chris Orr. Now these aircraft they're flying are SNJ Navy trainer aircraft that were used during World War II and the Korean conflict. Their demonstration shows these two aircraft flying in formation through rolls and other aerobatic maneuvers. Nearly every pilot in World War II and Korea trained in a variant of this aircraft. Now they base these aircraft right here in Hampton Roads at the Hampton Roads Executive Airport, which is right off 58. Uh, one of these aircraft even flew here during its military service. Both pilots also have some Hampton Roads history. Chris Thomas is a graduate of Norfolk State and Chris spent the 1990s as a firefighter for Virginia Beach. Today he flies for the airlines. Chris Orr was an F-14 and A-4 Skyhawk pilot and at one time was stationed right here at NAS Oceana. Check out a little bit more information about their aircraft. These are SNJ aircraft, they're actually Navy airplanes. I'm very lucky, my airplane was actually flown at Naval Air Station Norfolk in 1940. The other airplane's a 1942 SNJ-2. All, uh, all members of the team are bringing history to this area. I'm actually a local from Virginia Beach, and my teammate was actually assigned in VF-2, uh, one of the F-14 squadrons here in the 1990s. And you may remember these aircraft if you attended the NAS Oceana Air Show over the past, let's say, 10 to 15 years. They used to be part of the Geico Sky Typing team. Now that team doesn't exist anymore, so these two aircraft are purchased, and they'll be out here during the air show, uh, flying a really cool demonstration during the show Saturday and Sunday. Coming up in just a little bit, we're going to show you something else that's pretty cool during the 5.30 uh, half hour here on Wavy News 10. That's me riding with the Blue Angels today. Don't miss that. At NES Oceana, I'm your Ricky Matthews, 10 on your side. We can't wait to see that, Ricky. Thank